peace to everybody from you. I am the priest who is the long longest time here in Medjugorje from January 82. I came from Germany where I'm studying and started to work here. And uh, if I remember or if I think about uh, many questions, what I heard here and, uh, and about my responses to answers to the people, perhaps the very uh, one of the uh, questions was always, Our Lady asks only pray, pray, pray. And, and when we read her messages, we find only this a call, message, pray, pray, and good other messages as of peace, conversion. And people ask, ask this uh, by, because they want, or many of the people want, to hear from Our Lady uh, concrete invitations. For example, when the people come from Brazil, they ask why Our Lady does speak about social justice or injustice. When the people come from Poland or Slovakia, why she doesn't speak about problems of systems or dictators and so. If the people come from a movement of, for life, they ask why Our Lady do, doesn't speak about abortion and so many, many other things. And it is true, Our Lady spoke and speaks almost about the prayer. The most important uh, message in the her messages is the prayer. And I don't want now to defend Our Lady why she doesn't speak about other problems, concrete problems of the world. I understand something, understood something what helps me to understand why she does in this way. I tell you two examples. A young man from Switzerland came to Medjugorje 25 of February 85. He came with he came with, with many problems, especially problems, spiritual problems, and there's also problems the psychological level. He lose his peace, and uh, he was not able to do the last exam for uh, his piano, his mu mu musician. He came here. And during the apparition, he played Ave Maria from Schubert. He didn't participa participate by the apparition. She, he played only. He told me during this uh, apparition and he, during he played music of Ave Maria, he felt one peace and one joy in a credible way. And from this day, his life changed. And he did his last exam, and he's now a professor. And he's always in, in contact with us. And third, after th third pilgrimage to Medjugorje, he wrote me one letter. And he said, Father, what is happening with me? The first time in my life, after this uh, pilgrimage, I discovered the poor people exist in the world. And from this moment, from this experience, I have not more... I cannot be quiet because poor, the poor exist. And he started one movement called MEB, in Italian, Medjugorje per i bambini. In, in English, uh, the Medjugorje for the children. And he has now his uh, committee, and he is organizing concerts often through, the, through our Switzerland. And all money which is coming in through these uh, co uh, concerts he is giving for to the children. And in the last, uh, last, last December, before Christmas, they opened one house uh, for 200 uh, poor children in, near to Bombay, in India, 70 kilometers. And now he is building one other uh, house in Brazil, Eben, uh, also for uh, children who are poor. And, uh, in the last of one of the last letters, he wrote me, Father, it seems Our Lady doesn't like my music because I have not more time for the music because I have to work for, for poor people. And uh, it is interesting for me. He didn't, he didn't found in the messages, look for poor, for poor people or build the house in the Bombay, near to the Bombay, or give the house to the sisters who are looking for one house. He prayed, he converted, 
And uh, in the con his conversion, he found what he can do. And this is my answer always to the people. Convert. Pray. And through the conversion, you shall find what is your place and task in this world. Because conversion doesn't uh, conversion is one call to us. With, uh, you may find your place in the world, in the family. L because g when God created us, he, he gave us, he gave to the, uh, he, uh, to the human beings this word and, and told, work and submit this uh, world, creation. And uh, through the sin we lose our place. For this reason, conflicts. For this reason, wars. Because we, don't, we didn't find our place. And we cannot find our place through the, through the conflicts, through the wars. We can find our place and to use good our gifts only through the, through the conversion. Conversion also it me means to find again what you have to do. And this m young man is for me a special case how to, how, what can happen with us and what God, God can do with us if we convert, if we come back to us, to our place. Another small e uh, example, after one pilgrimage, pilgrimage, 50 people in the bus decided to open one, one house and to tell to all those pregnant women uh, who had problems or with his, uh, hus her husband or friend to come to them and uh, to, to save their life. They started perhaps one year ago and the organizer of this house said me, I don't know, two or three months ago, Father, we saved just 17 children. It was not in the messages opened the house and helped the people and saved their life. But they understood, they converted, I can tell, and they found what they can do. Our Lady is calling us to the peace, to the conversion, but peace is only one result of the new be behavior in our life. And I hope to everybody from you and for everybody who will listen to you after this, your conference, that you may find your place to the conversion, that you may, can, may use your gifts given to you to God. And uh, at last, I, for me, I discovered the biggest sin in the world. The biggest sin in the world is not abortion, it's not the, it's not the war, it's not the drugs. Biggest sin, sin we find by the omission, if we don't uh, try to grow in the love, to every problem, to every sin, to every distraction is door open. When we try to uh, grow in the love, we shall avoid every distraction. We shall have strength to avoid also the sin and to become at, at end the witnesses of peace, which can come only when we start through our love, without love and respect, our life and the, the uh, life of other people. In this sense, may Our Lady protect you and bless you.